Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of the Collector Car Canada Vehicle Review Podcast. Today, we're looking at a 1990 Alfa Romeo Spydro Quadrifoglio Series 3 convertible with a five speed manual and 62,000 miles. It's lot 184 on collectorcarcanada.ca. The 62K mile Ninety Alpha we have is finished in a brilliant silver over a grey with red interior. The color scheme on the interior goes uh, as part of the quadrifolio package that was offered in Series Three Alpha Romeo Spiders. Quadrifolio is Italian for four leaf clover, and this uh, some emblems signifying this trim level can be found on the car, both on the fenders as well as the rear spoiler. So the interior's got a gray, gray leather seats uh, over a blood red carpet, and that was the, uh, the color scheme for the Quadrifolio package. Uh, this is a U.S. market car, came to Canada in 2000, and with the low mileage, I think we can and the appearance on the underside. I think we conclude that it does not have any winters. So 62,000 miles over 34 years uh, of history. This car is averaging under 2,000 miles a year, which also lends credibility to the uh, supposition that there are no winters. Uh, so 62,000 miles, slightly under 100. Uh, another interesting piece about this car, which is also signified by emblems on the, these ones on the quarter panels, is that it's designed by the storied Italian design house, Pinin Farina. So emblems from Pinin Farina appear on the quarters. The car's got a two-liter inline four-cylinder engine. It's a twin cam, and it powers the rear wheels through a five-speed manual transmission. The convertible top is a soft top. It's black in color. Other exterior features include a front air dam, body colored crown effects, so, so a, a skirt down the side of each uh, rocker panel. Uh, as I mentioned, there's a rear spoiler, which, uh, which comes with badging on it as well. The, pow- the panel covering the cowl appears to have some red underneath some paint chips, and the owner believes that this panel would be the only one to have ever been replaced and believes it to be an otherwise original paint car. One of the fog lights is currently not functional, and there are a couple other exterior flaws we set out in the gallery for lot 184 on CollectorCarCanada.ca. The 1990 Alfa Romeo Spider sports its original 15-inch wheels. They're 6 inches wide at all four corners. And they're referred to as a 12-hole alloy uh, standard on the, uh, the alphas of the period. Four bolts, and they're skinned at an H-speed rated set of Michelin MXV4 XSE radials, 195.60 and all. Four-wheel discs are in place, and they're power-assisted in each corner. Most recent repairs relate to a clutch cylinder and battery in May 2024, and the invoice for that appears on our gallery. On the inside, as I say, the two bucket seats are trimmed in slate gray leather, uh, and there's a trimmed in red stitching. Both the stitching and the leather show a few flaws, and we do show those in the gallery. Panasonic AM FM CD head unit is in place, and the car is equipped with power windows and vent windows above the powered windows, powered side windows. There is an air conditioner equipped in the car, but that has not been tested, and we assume not function. The three-spoke steering wheel fronts a 140 mile an hour speedometer, and the six-character, six-digit odometer, as I say, shows under 62,000 miles. The tachometer, which has a max reading of 8,000 RPM, is not functional. The car, the car's engine, the two-liter double red cab engine, is uh, is fed by a Bosch Electronic fuel injection system. So it was rated 120 horsepower at 1500 RPM when new, uh, 
cultivated by 117,000 feet of torque. We do have a video on the listing of the engine running. So please take a look at that. So that concludes our description of the brilliant silver on gray and red 1990 Alfa Romeo Spider Quadrifolio Series 3 convertible with 5 speed manual. It's available on collectorcarcanada.ca as lot 184. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.